today. I'll guide you through the process of cloning a project from Azure DevOps using Sourcetry. Start by opening Sourcetry on your computer. If you don't have it installed, you can download it from the official website. In the top left corner of Sourcetry, you'll see a Clone New button. Click on it to initiate the cloning process. To get the information needed, go to Azure DevOps Git Repository. Let's set up at our public key first in Azure. Beside your profile icon, click the user setting and click SSH public keys. As you can see, I already have my SSH key added. If you don't have one, click the new key button. Open your terminal to check if you have SSH key installed. Change directory to .ssh. If folder is existing, then we are good to go. Under the .ssh folder, locate the id underscore rsa and id underscore rsa.pub. If you don't have .ssh installed, just run this command. For more info about SSH key installation, visit the Microsoft page. Once you have the SSH keys, locate the id underscore rsa.pub and copy the entire text. Go back to Azure DevOps portal and paste the key. Set the name as local machine and click add. Go back to your Azure project and click clone. And choose SSH then click copy. Go back to Sourcetry and paste the link. Click clone and done.